Hey there. Today we have seven, if I can count, packs of Astral Radiance left that I had laying around. And you notice I have my trusty scale once more. So we are going to be weighing packs and uh, seeing if we can guess if they have good cards or bad cards. 21.47. Do 1.4. Six stars. 21.4. Speed this part out for you. 21.42. All righty, now that we are weighed, let's, let's organize these. 26, 32, 40, 42. There we go. <clears throat> They're organized heaviest to lightest. Um, if you've watched the other items, other clips in this series, you know that the heavy packs are the ones that are not expected to have hits in it. And the light packs are the ones that should have hits in it, if I remember right. But every once in a while, something comes along and throws a change. And ooh, see, like this pack, I would not have assumed to have a hit in it. But let's find out. Okay. Six packs to go. This one was a little bit lighter than that one. See, white card card. Oh, here, there you go. One, two, three. Oh, see, that's throws everything off. Uh, Psyduck, Sudowoodoo, Overquill. The reverse is a bog. And a non, non hollow rear. Okay. These, all these around here, around the 40, 21.4, are the middle of the pack. And you'll notice that each, uh, each different set has a different, like, gram. Uh, some are. Did I just do that trick right? Yeah, I think I did. Okay. It doesn't matter. Some are like 22, 23. Uh, Asteroid Radiance, so though, is usually about 21 and a half grams. Versus Kirlia and Mamoswine. But I've noticed that since they've changed to uh, the new the new code cards, that the lighter, the heavier packs have the white code cards and you don't get a hit. And the lighter packs have the uh, dark code cards and you usually get a hit. Um, but yeah, every once in a while you do have one that's different. So nothing is an exact science, not like it was way long ago, but we're getting to the lighter stuff now. I'm hopeful for that one. 21.4 grams on this one. So I'm still expecting a white code card. Yep. Two, three, four. Overquill. Sorry, quillfish. Rufflet. Energy. Shoes. Arcanine Reverse Rare. And Regilecki. Okay, I am hopeful for these. 21.32 should give us a hit, I'm hoping. Yes, indeed. Here we go. One, two, three, four. Now, is it a just a hollow rare or is it a ultra rare? We don't know. Not yet. Energy. Ooh, I think I saw something really good back there. Uxy, Teddy Ursa, and ooh, a V Star. That's nice. There you 
they go together? Not really. Uh, okay. So we got a V and a V star out of six packs. And this is our lightest pack yet. So if you've enjoyed the series, there's more in it. Please uh, check those out and subscribe. I'll be doing this in the future. So if you don't want to miss those, subscribe. Uh, Magnemite. Uh, it's a weird artwork. Makes a Magnemite look huge. Energy. Glasses. Lilligant. And Gallade. See, so... The lightest packs isn't necessarily the best. It's kind of in the middle because the light packs, obviously this card's going to weigh less than this card. So the lightest packs are probably just going to have hollow rares and the lighter packs usually have ultra rares and then the heavy packs because the code card difference, the heavy packs uh, don't have anything. So. There you go. Now you know. Um, that's why you sh even even in 2022 you shouldn't buy loose packs. Somebody's probably weighed them. Anyways, until next time. Mm, bye.